Right, Shalom. I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahasham Yahushai, double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that rule well, and peace and blessings to the elect of the nation of Israel. Alright, this is Amma One from the Great Millstone Camp here in Trinidad, and I'm um, coming with our next lesson through the Spirit, you know, on the fact that we are to, we are to die in this truth, you know. When I mean that we have to die in this truth, you could take it twofold, literally, because meaning to because why? We have to we have to um we have to somehow we might be martyrs for Yahweh Shai's sake, but we have to die meaning we killing off that man that we once was and becoming something new. You know? We have to die here, die in this truth, die. The dead, like, alright, why I come up with that analogy is because it's like Yahweh Shai say, Follow me and I will make you fishers of men, alright? Um, Matthew 4. And 19. I'll read from verse 18. From verse 18, it says, And Yahushai, walking by the Sea of Galilee, saw two brethren, Simon called Peter, and Andrew's brother, casting a net into the sea, for they were fishers. And he said unto them, Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men. You understand? So, the, the, the outer fish men no no you being described as a fish in the in the analogy you being a man who might be a potential member of the elect of Yahweh Basham Yahushai you being described as a fish now what fish what a fish know I talk about an actual fish right a actual fish know um only one will you understand? He, he know only one world, one way of life, one way of thinking. Which is to be in the water and swim. You understand? That he will. Now well, when, he, when he get caught out of that uh, uh, world uh, and brought out in the, um, in, on land, alright? What he will do is beat up, beat up, beat up. Like, because he out of water, he out of he will. Beat up, beat up, beat up. And until either he die, or he go back to his comfort zone. Which is the sea. You understand? And you being die, you, you dying, is you actually cementing yourself in the truth. There's no other way for me to go but here in the truth. You be now I join the an, uh, uh, analogy or the example and putting it as I'm on a man now. When we was in the world, only one way we didn't know how to be a nigga, how to operate like a fool, you know, go party, go clubbing, you know, some of we might have be committing adultery, some of we might have be smoking weed. All we didn't know is what he saw teach you. Um, we, we, you know, we eating pork, shrimp, celebrating Christmas, celebrating his birthday, you know. Doing all kind of abomination, because I already didn't know. You understand? But we get, we get, we get, we, the fishers are the men, the apostles are great millstone, and the men who either brought anyone are we in, you know, the Holy Spirit, all of that, through the Holy Spirit, you know. Brought us in, and um, some uh, some men was like fish out of water, basically. You know, the beat up, beat up, beat up, beat up. Why is it was in the truth? The beat up, like fish out of water, and then jump back right into the pond, which is the world, and go back to the comfort zone. But you know, you had to uh, um um die you know you have to die meaning dying meaning you're cemented in the shoot you're dead 
to the world you're dead to your comfort zone and you 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 cemented in the truth now you you he's a new man you're no longer the same person you was back then you 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 knew being what baptized you understand so these um colossians 2 and 12 it says buried with him in baptism so it, yeah when you when you get baptized you're killing off that old man you understand wherein also you are risen with him through the faith now you you, you become you, you get baptized you bury that old man you rise up as a new man in, in the belief of Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shai through faith uh, you understand of whom the operation of the Most High had raised him from the dead all right it says and you being dead in your sins and the uncircumcision of your flesh had he quickened together with him having forgiven you all trespasses you understand so we that is what we did too we did to sins. we're not going back into that old crusty grimy ass nigga that we once was we we walk in what newness of life all right newness of life um romans 6 and 4 all right um I read from verse 1, it says, What shall we say then? Shall we continue in sin that grace may abound? Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh shall I forbid. How shall we that are dead to sin live any longer therein? Know ye not that so many of us as were baptized into Yahweh Shai were baptized into his death? Therefore we are buried with him, in, with him by baptism into death. That like as Yahweh Shai was raised up from the dead by the glory of the Father, even so we should walk in newness of life. Newness of you is a new creature, newness of life. You're no longer the same person. You understand? That is why I bring up. That is why I say you have to die in the shoot. And when you come into the shoot, you be you 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 why what, what what dying? That old man dying. You walk in as a new man now. You understand? And when you walk as a new man, you might become a martyr for you. What about Shami Who knows? The most high he way to uh, um, use you. So you might actually physically die. But your spirit liveth forever and ever and ever. You understand? Revelation 2 verse 10 it says fear none of those things which thou shalt suffer Behold the devil shall cast some of you into prison that he may be tried All right, he said the devil shall cast some of you into prison that he may be tried And you shall have tribulation ten days It says be thou faithful unto death and I will give thee a crown of life You understand? So now when you come into the truth you kill that old man you might actually physically perish but the lord say he will give you life a crown of life so you go have eternal life but that comes by faith in yahweh by hashem yahushai and none else you know none else but you had to kill that old man that old man in in making it into them chariots and as i listen to myself and as I listen to the Akim, you know, to the brethren around the four corners of the globe pushing this word out in truth and sincerity, you know, Apostle Elataha coined a new phrase, Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shai, um, Shalom, Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shai, Barakatam, um, no, what is the new phrase, Salak? Um, all praises to Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shai Ba'asham 
Raka Kodash Salak, yeah, that is it, that is it. You know? In in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. You know? That is what we that is what we um about. 2017 year um that destruction and diligence and, and we seeing brothers becoming more diligent, you know. And whoever ain't becoming more diligent, they will get weeded out, you know. That is just how it is. The most are not playing games. So we had a we had a um be on P's and Q's. But the but the main point is the main point is this. Um yo, the Lord the Lord say we had to die we had to we had to kill off that old man. We had to kill he. We had to kill he. He he had to dead. He half to dead. He ain't making it. To have no nigga that he once was making it on the ships. No nigga that he once was making it on no ships. Is as a Israelite man, the Lord coming to deliver a Israelite man. You understand? <clears throat> so, I feel with that I will close off. You know, and I will give all praises to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai and double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone that rule well. Peace and blessings to the elect. Shalom to the elect. Um, and give all praises again to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai by Hashem Rakakwadash. Shalom to the elect again. Peace.